That language, they live like vermin. Do you believe that that is, as your uh, Republican colleague Chris Christie has said, neo-Nazi rhetoric? This is what's wrong with the mainstream media. Focus on the substance and let's have an actual policy debate rather than talking to a presidential candidate instead of the policy substance of what's actually going on in the country, picking on some word that Donald Trump said on a certain day and asking me for comment on it. Give me a break. Here we go again. This video is brought to you by TatumStore.com. TatumStore.com. Get the merch link in the description section. Get you one of these shirts. We just launched a few new colors, and we're going to also launch these in sweatshirts. Um, I'm doing it all by myself, trying to get them loaded on the internet, so it's, it takes a little bit of time. But we're going to do sweatshirts on all of our products that are top selling, um, and we're also going to do a variety of colors in this. People like the blue color like this. It's almost Israeli blue, to be honest. And so we're trying to accommodate right before Black Friday. So we're going to keep the sale going. Um, beat down 30% off. It's crazy that I'm giving 30% off. I like I, it's just it's I'm actually dumb for doing it, but I love you guys anyway. And it ain't about the money for me. Um, but go to tatumstore.com, like and subscribe to the channel. Let's get into this, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Vivek Ramaswamy is, is whooping him again. Now, I'm gonna be honest and transparent. I haven't watched this video, but I know Vivek is gonna murder him. Now, my video guy sent this to me because I know. I know it has to be good for him to send it to me to react to. Vivek has been running the, the gamut. And I want you to comment in the comment section if you want me to make some Vivek merch because I got a merch idea for Vivek, kind of like the Trump gangster, like a Vivek gangster. Uh, let me know if you want to do that, and we'll donate some of the money that we get from that to his campaign. Uh, but he always do really good. I mean, he's very smart. He, he definitely should have a place in politics, in my personal opinion. I think he's probably an incredible CEO, and he should have a place in politics. If Donald Trump, Donald Trump should have him as vice president. A hundred percent, a thousand percent, because Vivek can do everything Trump can do as far as rhetoric and debating and challenging people. But he's reaching a younger crowd and a more diverse crowd that Trump is not reaching in comparison to what Vivek can reach and what he is reaching. And that's just my opinion about it. But uh, I, I guarantee it's going to be a beat down. Let's watch it together. Roll the clip. That language, they live like vermin. Do you believe that that is, as your uh, Republican colleague Chris Christie has said, neo-Nazi rhetoric? This is a classic mainstream media move. Pick some individual phrase of Donald Trump Focus on literally that word without actually interrogating the substance of what's at issue. The word was chosen for a reason. We are in the middle of a cultural war in this country. The well, word you know was what? It, it, it's reason. actually describing a series of behaviors. You have Antifa and other related groups that have been burning down cities for the last three years in this country. Would you describe them Wildly as vermin? violating the rule of law. We have an invasion on our southern border. We have millions of people crossing our southern border. Let's talk Thank about you. the substance okay. of why we have to recognize would, that we're not in would ordinary you, times. Would you so use that language yourself? The vocabulary of the vermin or not is not what's important. Well, I haven't used that language. So, so you can look you? at my, my track record on the campaign trail. I talk about the issues. We all talk about them differently. But what I'm not going to do is play some game of focusing on some word that somebody else said without ignoring entirely the substance of what we're actually talking about. A border crisis of historic proportion. Economic stagnation we haven't <laughs> seen in 50 years. A national identity crisis. In the <laughs> they picked the wrong dude to put on there. They want to talk about stupid vermin. Like loss of national pride in the next generation that's potentially existential for this country. Let's talk about our dependence on China. Today we're actually talking about Xi Jinping, picking on Donald Trump's word vermin. She don't know where to go. That status quo. You know what's vermin? What's running around San Francisco on a given day before Gavin Newsom cleaned it up on a dime to roll out the red carpet for Xi Jinping. If he could do that for Xi Jinping, he could have done it on an ordinary day. And yet we're here sitting talking not about the substance of that, but on one word that Donald Trump said in some speech in Miami. This is what's <laughs> wrong with the mainstream media. Focus on the substance and let's have an actual policy debate rather than talking to a presidential candidate instead of the policy substance of what's actually going on in the country. Picking on some word that Donald Trump said on a certain day and asking me for comment on it. Give me a break. God. Vivek be like I, I feel like he must got his legs under him or his wife must have did something I don't know what she did to him maybe she gave him a back rub or something I, I don't know but Vivek has like elevated or escalated his challenging of people and it's and it's brilliant no response she has no response to what he said she can't respond to that the reason why she can't respond to that is because 
he is concerned with substantive things. Vermin and com people are sick of this. Nobody care about him saying vermin. To be honest, I I've heard like vermin. I think it maybe the word is in the Bible somewhere. I don't even know what that word means. I ain't never used that word. It, it, she taught us a dog whistle to Nazis or something. Man, ain't nobody even know what it means. How many people know that they have a let me look it up real quick. Now, now, you know, since she said it and the mainstream media are pushing an agenda, they may actually have an article written about the word vermin. Let me look up the word vermin while I'm sitting here doing this video. Vermin meaning. What does vermin mean? The definition of vermin means wild animal that are believed to be harmful to cop to crops, farm animals, game, or, or they carry disease, i.e. rodents. Okay. <laughs> Parasite, wor worms, or, or insects, people perceived as despicable and as causing problems for the rest of society. What? That sounds like a perfect de definition of the way people are acting. The third definition on here says people perceived as despicable and as causing problems for the rest of society. The, here we go. The, the other example is the vermin who ransacked her house. How is this not a real like in the definition? Don't say nothing about uh, white supremacy and, and Nazis. And it, it gives a, a, a that's a great. Actually, I'm going to start using that word vermin. What is she talking about? This is not substance. Donald Trump said something. It's a dog whistle. The dog whistling. He dog whistling because. Because we dog whistling to the white man. I'm sick of these people. Thank you, thank you, Vivek, for slapping this woman around because she should be ashamed of herself asking you something stupid on television. I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye -bye.